based on the length of time that we've gone in the search, the extensive search efforts that we've put into it, the water temperature, that at this point we do not believe that we're going to find any of these individuals still alive. And so this evening at about uh, 7.30, we are going to suspend the active search and rescue efforts. Coast Guard's not going away. None of our partners are going away, but we're just going to transition to a different phase. We've got very difficult water temperatures. You have structures from the bridge that are in the water that can move with the tides and currents, making that dangerous for divers and people in the water to actually try to do recovery. The last thing we want to do is put divers in the water with changing currents, low temperatures, very poor visibility, visibility and so much metal and other unknown objects in the water. All it takes is one object to strike an individual and all of a sudden we have a first responder trying to recover another first responder. I think at 0600 we'll find ourselves in a better position to understand the dynamics of what we're dealing with and to address the issue in a much safer manner.